Welcome back. I'm Jay. We've got Steve right here. This is the Heads Up Show. Thank you so much for joining. We are going over your photographs today. Mm -hmm. Um, Steve, we got a couple of really kick-ass helmets here. We just shot a video talking about these. If you have not seen that video yet, but you want to learn about these helmets and all the things that make them special, go ahead and click up here. You can check that out. You can actually enter a contest to win some stuff. Yep. Do whatever you want. Um, <laughs> that was pretty good, too. We didn't practice that, I promise. Yeah. No, yeah. I didn't see it. Yeah, <laughs> if you yeah. want to be on this show, and I know you want to be on this show, Take the best pictures you can of your helmets, collectible, field use, doesn't matter, and email them to picks at greengridiron.com. This is like the longest running series we ever did. We're on like episode, I don't know, 65, 66. 65,000. And we have so many more pictures to get to. So we really do want to see what you have. And you can write a little blurb. I usually put them on here. And um, lately we've been doing 10 to 15 photos. Today, I'm keeping it on the shorter side to 10. First up is Max. All right, Max. I'm immediately seeing flavors of the UNC Tar Heels on this one. Looks like kind of a Carolina blue. Certainly does. And Stingrays. It's isn't Stingrays. Were they uh, a semi-pro team? I don't know, man. I'd be lying if mm. I. You know. I don't know. I don't know. Is there any history behind this? No, no write up, nothing. Just a couple of cool pictures outside. One thing caught my eye though, man. Like this is this is a photo tip right here. You gotta clean the bird crap off the oh, table boy. before you send in your pictures. Oh boy. Or a car. This is, looks like a car. Or right? your car. Like, bro, that that's a nice looking helmet and you got the reflection with a nice you know, bluebird do, turd. Do there. we um, do we subtract points for uh, <laughs> the turds? It's too funny. Anyway, but the, hel but the helmet is great. <laughs> exactly. I like the color scheme. You got navy blue with the lighter blue. I'll call it a, you know, for lack of a better name, a Carolina blue. White face max uh, with a little bit of black, kind of all over the place on, on a blackout package. That's nice. No, nice. I'm gonna start this guy off at a six point nine. Okay. All right. Sure. I like it. Good job, Max. Why not? Thank you. Next up is Tanner. Only one photo, which is a little bit of a bummer, but... I don't think it's a bummer because I think Tanner knows that he's got something special here. Only needs one picture. So what he's done is he's taken these purple uh, tiger stripes to match this face mask. And this looks like a um, Vikings purple mask. And I think it looks cool. It's almost in, a, in the... It looks like these stripes are on here a little bit differently than... Cincinnati Bengals stripes, right? They are, especially up front. But I like the way that they all come together near the ear mm -hmm. actually a little bit better. This is a great job yeah, and a really like, good use. like something opening up. Right. Right? Right. Yeah, I like it a lot. Um, the red on the Riddell, mm. does, it doesn't work for me. I'm pretending I don't see it. I know. it's on. I mean, it is what it is. Right. Unless you're going to go with black, which is gonna, then going to be black and white, which would have been a little bit better. But unless you're going to get, you know, a purple or a, a front bumper or 3D bumper uh, for the, for, to cover that up, you know, with some purple in it, you're kind of stuck with you're it, beat. right? Yeah. yeah. But, you know, yeah. the visor looks good. Um, got the mouth guard, mouth guard in there. This is a youth helmet, looks like. Yep. Uh, black chin strap. I don't hate that either. I'm going to go with a six point, eh, I'll go with a 6.9 on that guy too. Ooh. I think it's going to be a stingy score day, huh? I think it might be. Maybe so. Maybe so. <laughs> All right. Next up is William. Also one picture, but again, really solid. And I know you're going to notice certain things about this, but there's a lot happening with this subtly. There is. And right, so the, the things that I'm seeing first, obviously we got 3D bumpers. This is a Browns helmet. The, the orange looks a little off, but what's nice when it's really lit like that, you get to see that this is a brown face mask and not a black face mask. Obviously you've got uh, the clips in there. We've got some of these clips. We actually provide them to the Browns. In this color, Steve, Cleveland Brown. Hey, who knew? So, so we've dubbed. <laughs> uh, and then you've also got the brown stickers on the Oakley visor. That's nice as well. And you got an orange chin strap I'm going to assume that the chin strap says Riddell on the side of it, but I don't see it anywhere. I agree. The only thing I can think of is maybe he flipped it or yeah. because if he took it off, he would have taken it off the cup too. But yeah, dude, you're right. Really cool idea putting that orange chin strap on there. And you know, in the orange looks nice. That front 3D bumper is just the perfect little cherry on top. And I'll tell you one thing that I might do differently here because you, you, you're going with the orange chin strap which the Browns do not wear because all NFL teams have to wear white chin straps. Um, but 
if you're going to tweak it a little bit, let's tweak it a little bit more. So, Steve, you know what else we, all, we just got in? <laughs> we got in white face mask clips for the Speedflex as well. Those would look really cool on here. And do one more thing of white to kind of to bring that white stripe and the white, uh, you know, back and, you know, front and back bumpers together. Dude, you're right. I, the, can, I can see it. Like the, the silver on these, you know, it really, it really helps. But man, the white on that would look awesome. There you go. And oh. I'm going to go with this guy. Uh, I love the visor uh, and, the, and the color combinations with the brown and getting all that stuff matched up. That's not, uh, you, you, got, you got to do a little bit of work to get to that point. I'm going to mm -hmm. go, Steve, with a 7.8. There we go. Okay, I like it. This one is from Jordan and Ryan. Okay. So there we go. And I know you're not normally a fan of the Dutch, that angle stuff, but this is cool. Nice filter they put on it. It's really well lit. They Different. got the Red Bull over there, so obviously they're, they're, they're fired up, man. Oil, they're kind fired of up. These things together. Yeah. They got the Yankee candle in the background doing its thing. All right, yeah. all right. We got black helmets. One's matte black, one's gloss black. We got uh, the green gridiron 3D bumpers on here, so obviously love that. We got Under Armour. Uh, they both under looks like one might be Nike and the other one's Under Armour as far as visors go. Or is That's that a shock? shock? Oh, sorry, it's a shock 1.0. It's a little dark, hard to see. And then we got an Under Armour in the other one. We've got the S2BDC TX. I'm sorry, the SF2BDC uh, TX face mask on the Speed Flex. My favorite. And the OBJ, which is the CUS2BDSW on the Speed. And then we looks like we've got matching. Sports star chin straps on both of them. T Rex Hurricanes is what I'm going to guess, but kind of hard to tell. So, Steve, I'm going to go with, let's see, on this one, you know, it's, um, I'm going to give Jordan a 7.2 <laughs> and Ryan a 6.9. How do you know who's is who? I don't know. You just, yeah. The, the, okay. Yeah. Hey. So, Jordan. Good job, Jordan. Jordan, you win. <laughs> you got the better one. I just don't know which one it is. I like the duo submission, by the yeah. way. That's yeah. cool. All right. Next up is Vince stirring the pot here with his camo name that shall not be mentioned team, huh? Yes. Look at that. The Washington football team. <laughs> and this is interesting because what we have here, take a, let's take a closer look at this face mask. So this face mask, Steve, is a S2B, and it's it's a little bit different here on the sides than normal. This is a style that we've started. We've started to see the style popping up. Uh, we've actually oh, got yeah, some in, and it looks good on this helmet. It looks really good on this helmet. It matches the outer ring of the logo up. Uh, perfect. Perfectly. Yeah, because it's Green Bay Gold, so yeah. the color of the mask is Green Bay Gold, it, which and it, it's got, this has got to be really bright light because this color oh, is a yeah. little bit um, darker, richer than what we're seeing in this photo. Um, but I got to think that it's light, the light doing that. Yeah, right? and we got some long shadows there. It's uh, it's definitely getting cold Where up is there. This? this is one, Washington D.C., right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yep. I don't know if I've ever been to this. Monument. Oh, oh yeah, I have. It's pretty cool. It's a it's a sight to see. Yeah, yeah especially yeah. this time of year. It's nice going out there, but. Really smart taking it Semper, out there. Semper Fi in the back. I got, I got a feeling he's an ex-Marine. Uh, I would most certainly say um, yes. And I got to say that I would not, you know, when I first saw this, I'm like, that type of military camo with the color yellow, I don't know. I don't know how I feel about that. But even just looking at the more I'm seeing it's it. It's growing on me. It's growing on me, too. Um, what we need on this, though, is we need, um, we need some bumpers. Yes. I think. The nice big W okay. on there. Who, who is this? Vince. Vince. Vince, give us, contact us. We just got in some. We're going to put some samples together to send up to Washington. Uh, maybe we'll have an extra one we can hook, hook you up with. See that? Paces. There you go. It, it would look good on that one. Mm hmm. Yeah, man. What are you giving Vince? All right, Vince. Let's go with, uh, I think there's a lot going on. To, to really kind of take this thing up a notch. So oh, I'm going to yeah. go with, uh, I'm going to go with an 8.1. Ooh, all right, man. I yeah. like that. Yeah. It's super unique, too. Yeah, it looks really cool. Nice work. All right. Next up is Tori. All right, Tori. So Tori's trying to be sick. What, 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 what has he got going on here? Is this on a carpet? It's or, in snow. Or is it out in the snow? Yes, sir. Are you sure that's snow? Yeah. yeah. I guess that is snow. Oh, yeah. That's snow. I looked really what hard. What does this say? Rally? Rally. Is that something that Notre Dame does? I don't know. 
did a rally. Uh, or that they put that on their chin straps? I don't know. Maybe they do. If they do, I didn't I didn't I have not noticed it. If this was a competition on contrast, you would win. Oh yeah, is this good? Yeah, because I mean Well it's super contrast T, but is it do you think that this is a good contrast? Well, I do because it's not like he just put this on white. It's an actual object that's white. And then he still was able to get all this smashing and throwing in your face all mm -hmm. of that color. Um, it's great. Yeah, it is all, it, the snow is all blown out, which looks cool. Right. And it almost looks like a product shot, except for when you look just a little bit close, you can tell it. Right. It's not. I thought it was a carpet at first. Yeah. Um, we, but here's what we got here. This is a gold helmet. And this is the shut um, F7. I'm going to assume this is a, yeah, this is a VTD. Uh, we've got the Irish or the Notre Dame front 3D bumpers. We've got the gold clips, which look great. You know, the face mask clips in the chrome yeah. look really nice on there. That Lime Fusion mask or grill. Yeah. Wow. It's that just... Lime Fusion visor proves once again you can really put yeah. any color and in. And green makes sense with Notre Dame, obviously. Look at the Irish, man. I really like this one. And, uh, you know, I would have liked, I wouldn't have mind to see a Clemson Notre Dame finals. But, yeah. Yeah. You know, we maybe, gotta, maybe we next gotta, year. I'm rooting for Alabama this year. Steve, who are you rooting for? Oh, Alabama. Okay. Yeah. There we go. Who are you rooting for? Mm -hmm. uh, this one, Steve, I really like it. I'm going to go with a another one that I really like. I'm going to go with a. I'm going to go with an 8.5. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, I love this one. The Notre Dame gold is just great. Yeah. That thing was just screaming to be on this. Uh, that's how you get on this show. Those bastards. All right. Next up is Ben. And. Uh, He's got his little football blanket set up he as a does. backdrop. It's a little distracting. It's a lot distracting. Mixed in with the horses, yeah. the Mustangs, mm -hmm. I'm assuming, on the stripe. I kind of like, oh, you got a Mustang on one side here. We don't have a good side shot from the other side. Oh, right? you're right. But that looks, I'm wondering, I bet you that's just a horse head because it looks pretty big. So I like, I'm a big fan of the Ford Mustang. Yeah. And SMU has a Sun Mustang. And this looks like a Mustang that's very similar to that as well. We got the shock. Zero G visor in this Speed Flex with some Under Armour clips. We got. You see how it says, I guess, Mavericks on his chin strap? Mavericks. So maybe the team is the Mavericks and they got some custom chin straps made. So that's nice. And we got black um, clips. I'm wondering if those clips are the ones that came from us. As far as I know, we're the only ones really selling them or if they were painted. The, the face, mask, face clips. mask clips, yeah. yeah. You know, <clears throat> the. They look um, a little shiny. They look very shiny. That looks great with the black clips. Mm -hmm. This is like a commercial for the shock zero G to see how well it fits in that. Look at that. You oh, can't yeah. fit, you can't it, fit a yeah, piece good. of paper in there. It's good. It's That's good. great, man. Uh, so overall on this guy, Steve, well, how do you think about the photo? I was general. just going to say, so listen, you made the show. You got too much going on. You put the effort, but it's a little jarring. There's a lot happening, but I am not mad at it whatsoever. Here's I'm, how you fix that. I'm a little mad at it. Uh, what I would do is, if you want to set that backdrop up, that's cool. But like, take the helmet away from it. So those are just kind of like a blurred shape. But hey, man, you made the show. Yeah, there you go. You made the show. <laughs> I'm going to go with a 6.7. Okay. With this guy. But we got right. some really good uh, details in there with the black clips and the black clips and the, the zero G. Yeah, yeah. All right. Next up is Steve. Hey, man. This is All how right. you take a pretty picture outdoors. Really you, nice. You got some nice bokeh. Sure does. Or bokeh. Mm -hmm. You got some, um, this is interesting, Steve. So you got a Zenith helmet. You've got an Oakley prism visor. You've got a Sports Star chin strap with Sports Star clips on the top and the Douglas clips uh, or buckles, easy, easy pro easy snaps mm -hmm. on the bottom, which as anybody knows, I absolutely love. You got white uh, face mask clips and then you got white. Pfizer clips. There is a lot done to this helmet. Steve, on, on this guy, I'm going to go with a, I'm going to go with a 8.1. Yeah. There He's you got go. a lot of nice, unique pieces in there. Yeah, good job, Steve. Yeah. All right. Next up is Joey. All right, Joey. The two-parter. So we got a signature down on that Cowboys helmet. Uh, got a blue visor, which is nice. Not a, That's Dak right there, too. Yeah. Not an Under Armour blue visor. We yeah. had those. We can't get them anymore. They're gone. But this is, I'm, I'm not sure what this, what brand that is. Uh, we got the SF2EGTX face mask uh, with some under, with the gray Under Armour clips. So that looks great. 
the decals on this almost look like a chrome. But I don't but they aren't. Right. You think that's just the the contrastiness of I and, think and, and the reflections. And how I think hitting? it's nice lighting. It, there's clearly some windows over on this side. Mm -hmm. It's just really lighting it up proper. He's got it in this beautiful glass case. My mm -hmm. goodness, that is. I've been thinking about selling glass cases because we've had people ask about them. So let us know what you think. Should we start selling uh, glass cases? I just don't want to deal with broken glass. I know. I know. Yeah. yeah, we're not gonna. We're not gonna. <laughs> let's be honest. We're not gonna do it. And then the the cowboy's helmet on the top. I'm not sure. I've I've seen that visor before with the curves and stuff. I don't know what it is. Um, I, I'm really honestly. I don't. I don't love that. Um, I like the color of it, but it's it's too much for me personally. Um, but I'm curious what what kind that is. Two very different looks. Mm -hmm. And even as a Giants fan, I got to say that bottom one is just mm -hmm. so classic and iconic. It's it's a beautiful helmet. The bottom helmet brings it up. You got Dak's signature on there, and someday that'll be worth nothing. No, <laughs> I, 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 I joke. I joke. It's a joke. It's a joke. <laughs> oh wow. Um, so uh, I'm gonna go, Steve, with a. I'm gonna go with an 8.3. All right. On, on those guys. Yeah, well deserved. All right. Next up, but last of the day, are two different ones from Riley. Okay, so this first one here, it's got a big W on it. It's gold. It's Kind of the W's in the shadow, so that could be a dark purple. We got like smoke or something going on in the background. Is that like from a lawnmower or a smoke bomb? It's smoke. I think he set up maybe a flare. Okay. That would be my guess. Now, the red one, that Cardinals look, everything about this is so awesome. Man, those red sports star buckles on that chin strap would just be incredible. Yes, and I would even then go one step further. Take the get, warning label yeah, off. Yeah, get it, get it, get it, get it. Get that warning label out of there. And you could, and this is a matte helmet, so you could put a gloss red warning label on there. Exactly. And then the only thing in white that you've got really is the whites of yeah. the Cardinals' eyeballs. You're onto something with this red helmet. Is looks great. It's beautiful. The, the visor looks great in here too. And this is more evidence that you can get away with any color in any yeah. in any color visor works pretty much. Yeah. Um, the W, if it's dark purple, this is a Washington helmet. Uh, sans the chin strap, but I like how the I, I don't really like the positioning of the shadow because you're kind of losing the the colors in the side if there are colors. But I like how clean. That zero G visor looks well, but did you notice the visor? By the way, oh yeah, it's a zero G visor in the speed helmet. I didn't see. So when I saw that, I was like, "Huh." Here, and here's the thing: so the zero G visor is made specifically for the Riddell Speedflex helmet. And we get questions all the time: "Hey, does this fit that? Does this fit that? You know, this other helmet?" And I'm like, "Well, it's made for the Speedflex helmet. Yeah, can you get it to fit?" Yeah, you can get it to fit. You can get pretty much anything from any brand. You can you can make it fit, right? Right. right. But it's made for the Speedflex helmet. So if I I don't want to go out and say, yeah, you can get this thing and it'll fit in any helmet you want, because the reality is you're going to be fighting for with these things. So you can see on this helmet. And this is I'm going to guess this is a collectible helmet. But when you look to see where the top of the visor is compared to those clips, it's underneath those clips. It's not, visors aren't really designed to go underneath the face mask clips. It looks great. Yeah. I but love it. It will break, though, if it was a field use. Well, one. something. It, it's just, you're, you're altering kind of the yeah. the design of, of the whole piece, and you don't want to put yourself in a, in a situation where something bad could happen. But... Yeah. It looks, it looks great. I love that he did it <laughs> because I wanted to see one for a while. Sure. And on a collectible, I say, eh, go for it. Uh, a lot of good stuff going on again. Let's go, Steve, with a 7.7. 7. All right. I like it. And that is all that we have time for today, man. That went really fast as usual. Thank you so much for your submissions. If you didn't make it, I'm sorry. Wait till I'm next time. No, I'm not Jay's sorry. not sorry. Keep your photos coming. Email the best pictures you can to pics at greengridiron.com. And thank you again for watching. Yes, P-I-C-S at greengridiron.com. It's an email address. Right. Uh, thank you so much again. Leave your comments below. Like, subscribe, click the notification bell. Until next time, cheers. Cheers.